thing. So right at the beginning of the song, we have a little bit of reduction here. That's good. What about here? So that's living pretty well right there. Again, you make that attack really fast. And you've just lost the sweetness of that uh, that initial transient. So I'm assuming it's probably going to be around that five or six milliseconds. So that seems to be a good place for most guitars, either you know bass guitar or a rhythm guitar is that if you can set that so that it can just let just the first little part in, if you set a ton of it through, then those peaks will overwhelm everything else. But if you set it too low, I feel like I've just hammered this this um, uh, point, you know, maybe, maybe a little bit too much, but that's really kind of the sweet spot. And you need to work it out depending on, I mean, it'll be different on nylon string guitars, a steel string guitars if you're finger picking uh, versus if you're you know playing with a... Um, uh, a pick or like I said thumb slapping here with a guitar big changes that you can only really find by just dialing around this attack time let's do another example with a electric guitar just playing basic single notes let's listen to this I've got the uh, compressor bypassed <laughs> So you can see how that sustained note, uh, the sustained note, falls away right about here. Now this is a little misleading because uh, a distorted guitar will naturally be compressed. Uh, the very nature of distortion is that the the circuit is being overloaded so much it just can't soak up any more uh, input at all. So it tends to have kind of a natural compression here. But this will just for, for this example, you can see how that really drops away. And so what we can do is by placing a compressor on there, we can, in essence, kind of ramp up some of this part, uh, some of this part, particularly if we just bring up the makeup gain. So let's check this out. <laughs> So that works out well, particularly if you want that there's no tighten up that attack so that those initial peaks will just get clamped down and then this will really, really get squashed. Uh, because I speeded up that attack, I probably have to bump up the makeup gain here and let's have a listen. <laughs> So you can see with that fast attack, the, the, the note, even though here on the, on the graph, we can see that note really dies away. You have a look at it over here. It really doesn't have a lot of variance there. That's because we've had a very fast attack.